Hi everyone and welcome to today's run. So today is Sunday and I'm out on my weekend long run and right now I'm on my way over to Shear to meet up with the guys from Surrey Trek and Run and I'm going to be joining them on one of their weekend group runs. So really looking forward to this to round out this week's worth of training. So quick update for you guys as well what I've been up to over the last week or so. Um, I didn't release a video last week um, and that's mainly because it's a bit difficult to provide good content for you guys especially in these wintry months when it's so dark and uh, I've been going out either really early in the morning or later in the evenings and as I say it's really dark so it's far, hard to find things to uh, to make videos about and provide good content for you worth watching so I thought instead of just putting out darkness <laughs> and wasting your guys time I thought I wouldn't release a video last week I just went out got my runs done and uh, yeah enjoyed it so yeah really good uh, quality training over the last couple of weeks I've been really pleased with the mileage I've been able to hit um, and that's because basically I've had something to focus on like um, having the Centurion one slam to keep me motivated and have a goal to aim towards with my running has been really beneficial over these last couple of weeks so i'm really pleased with my efforts on towards that uh, i'll put up on the screen how i'm getting on i think i'm about 340 miles or so into it currently i mean after today i'll be a bit further on but yeah i'll put up on the screen some how i'm getting on and uh, yeah as i say i'm really pleased with how that's progressing um i only entered the 400 mile one but um I've got quite a while to go to the end of the event so I might step it up and try and push out 500 miles um, before the 11th of March but we'll see we'll see when I finally finish off the 400 so that's a quick update on that um, coming up on the channel over the next couple of weeks um, we've got the last of the Star Backyard Trail uh, events and this one's going to be taking place in Pease Lake and that's going to be on the uh, 24th of Feb so yeah another couple of weeks till that one and I plan to run that one with Zachary because we ran it together last year and I think it'll be nice just to do it again with him this year and uh, see if we can get a PB on the Pease Lake course so yeah that should be fun so keep an eye out for that on the channel as I say on the 24th of Feb now uh, coming up in the future obviously we're going to be starting training for see, the North Downs Way 50 and the North Downs Way 100 but my plan for that is to mainly focus on my training for the North Downs Way 100 because in the past North Downs Way 50 has been documented well on YouTube I'll put some links below to Dan Run's channel he's done two years worth of training blocks for that race and he documented it really really well like what he was doing and the race day itself so if you want any more information about the North Downs Way 50 uh, I would highly suggest you go and check out Dan Run's channel below and also Ben from Time on Feet as well he put together a really great training series and he put in an absolutely fantastic performance last year at the North Downs Way 50 as well so go and check out his channel links are in the description so my plan for my training blocks and you know displaying it to you guys here on YouTube um, will be I think I'm just going to focus on the North Downs Way 100 so North Downs Way 50 is basically just going to be treated as a training run which will sort of fit in relatively early I guess in the training block for the North Downs Way 100 so I think my plan is when I get to about 18 weeks out from race day uh, of the North Downs Way 100 I will start my training series here on YouTube so if you're interested to see what I'm going to get up to in terms of training towards that race please subscribe and uh, yeah stick around for when that all kicks off because I really can't wait to get it started and it's going to be one hell of a journey for sure so yeah that's it that's my little update and sun is coming up absolutely beautiful morning yeah there it is as well box hill looming off in the distance for now we're heading this way to share right that's it for now i'll leave you guys here crack on with the rest of this run get myself to the shop and meet up with the gang 
So, here we go.
Okay, so we're just coming towards the end of today's run and I'll put up on the screen how I did today for today's long run but loads of fun out on the trails with the track and run team awesome good to catch up with Danielle as well shout out to her she just finished the arc of attrition last week so yeah she's still well and truly in recovery mode and for her to come out today and lead us all around on a nice little 10k loop amazing absolutely amazing so huge shout out to Danielle Harris links are in the description for her Instagram so give her a follow over there but uh, yeah that's it for today's video guys if you like what you've seen please press the like button and if you're new to the channel please consider subscribing for more running videos like this so that's it take care stay safe and I'll see you all in another video peace <laughs> Oh my god, it's a bit, 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 it's a b